Nina, who's engaged to Logan Paul, is taking legal action against a guy named Dylan Dennis. They've been trying to serve Dylan Dennis with some legal documents to kickstart the court case. But it's been a bit of a wild ride because Dylan Dennis has been playing hard to get. He's been kind of ignoring them and even making fun of the whole situation. One day they spotted someone who looked like Dylan Dennis on the street. It was their golden opportunity to finally hand over those important documents. They approached this guy thinking it was Dylan, but as it turns out, it wasn't him. The person they confronted claimed to be a Dylan duplicate. Now you might be wondering what that is. Well, it's someone whose job is to deliver legal papers to the right people. So, they tried to give the documents to this person, but Dylan Dennis, or at least the guy they thought was him, wasn't having it. Oh, hey, sir. I have a document for you. What's that for? Mr. Dennis? Yes, that is. I know it's you. What's up, man? It's yours, sir. <laughs> you gotta take it, sir. Are you a uh, lawyer? Uh, I'm a process server. There you are, sir. Take over to my building. Here you are. You got your document. It's undocumented. It's documented, Mr. Dennis. Mr. Dennis, documented. You gotta take it. Y'all are late. Dylan asked the person if he was the process auditor, and the guy replied, I'm a process auditor. That's when it hit them that Dylan Dennis probably wasn't going to cooperate. It's all a bit confusing, you know? Anyway, they kept trying to serve those documents, and they even recorded it all. These attempts to serve the documents might actually mean something in a court of law, but who knows how long this game of cat and mouse will continue before it gets really messy. Now... Here's the twist. Dylan Dennis even tweeted later, saying that the guy they confronted on the street wasn't him and that he had no idea who that person was. So, it's a bit of a mystery. What's important here is that all this drama doesn't ruin the build-up to a potential boxing match between these two. It would be a shame if all these court hearings ended up cancelling the big fight. We'll have to wait and see how it all unfolds. What do you folks think about this whole situation? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in and subscribe for new videos.